Hello, my name is Ashley. Today I'm going to make you Middle Eastern tabbouleh. If you do as I say, the result will be perfect. What we need is three bunch of parsley, four cucumbers, half a bunch of mint, four to five tomatoes, one onion, and one red onion, because I don't have green onions, one red pepper, and green, one green pepper, and one lemon, half a cup of olive oil, or you can use mazola or um, canola oil, and we need half a cup of bulgur, salt and pepper, and it's optional if you like to put pomegranate in it, which is the best, it gives the best taste. The bulgur you always have to soak in water before you start anything, so it will swell like this. We don't need more than this, and that's all. You follow the direction and everything will be perfect. Now we're going to start to chop them. The reason that I'm not peeling the cucumbers, they are fresh from my garden. Most vegetables they are from my garden. And you see them, I'm chopping everything very, very small pieces. They are very tasty, delicious. You take the stems out. All you need the leaves of the mint. All the vegetables that we are doing this tabbouleh, it has a lot of antioxidant. It's very, very healthy for you. We cut the stems out. Squeeze the lemon. Alright, now uh, we have to mix the tabbouleh. If you like, you can use big spoon or you can put uh, disposable gloves. I want to tell you one thing. This tabbouleh can stay in your refrigerator for a whole week if you don't put any seasoning on it. No lemon, no zeit, no olive oil, no bulgur, no nothing. So what it is is what you do is you mix all together and this is the seasoning which is the lemon and here is about a half a cup of olive oil like I said you can use mazola, you can use canola oil here is the salt and pepper Now it's important the lemon, the oil and the bulgur stay separate from vegetable. Because if you mix, it will be spoiled in a day or two. So whenever it's ready to serve, you can mix them together as much as you want. And that's how you serve it. With a little tabbouleh, vegetables, like this. You put a little bit of the seasonings, the liquid, and you put some of the bulgur. The bulgur always you can prepare it last minute. We don't need too much. There. And you mix together. And this is the best tabbouleh. Now that we are finished preparing the tabbouleh, it's optional to put pomegranate. In my opinion, this is the best part of the tabbouleh. You mix it. and you will enjoy it. Bon appetit and have fun.